The San Antonio River is the heart of our city, a source of life and sustenance, inspiration and commerce for thousands of years. Native American tribes were drawn to its pristine banks, and Spanish settlers seeking new opportunities found ample resources along its shores to farm and work the land. As more and more explorers and immigrants were attracted to this bountiful source of clear flowing water, the city we call home was born. As the city grew up around the river, heavy rains often brought devastating floods to those living and working in the heart of the city. In the 1950s, the river was straightened, channelized, and in some areas lined with concrete in an effort to put an end to the massive flooding. The San Antonio River Foundation is part of an effort to bring the river back to its citizens. Together with Bear County, the City of San Antonio, the San Antonio River Authority, and the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, we are expanding the usable river beyond the downtown river walk and creating an inviting, inspiring place for every generation of San Antonian from every part of the city. Some of the San Antonio River Foundation's most recognized contributions shine along the Paseo del Arte in the northern museum reach of the river. Here, the natural beauty of the river is accentuated with vibrant public art, creating an inspiring pedestrian corridor in the heart of the city. What the River Foundation pulled off in a very short period of time, under a year really, is really unprecedented in my professional career. I've, I've never seen so many projects proposed, conceptualized, and realized in such a short time frame. What this project has done for San Antonio as a whole is really quite remarkable because it's tied San Antonio's downtown area to the San Antonio Art Museum, to the Pearl Brewery, and it's really providing a corridor for people to access downtown where they may have seen it as two distinct districts before, now it's all one continuous community. My connection to the river is with my business, Rum Wild Sports, here at Pearl. We're part of the museum reach. We can take off and go for an hour walk if we want to, or an hour jog. So it's been great having a fitness-oriented shop right here with the river in our backyard. In the southern Mission Reach, this creative embellishment of the river continues on footbridges, benches, neighborhood parks, and portals linking the river and the missions, which are the city's historical and cultural foundation. I can come out here on my bicycle and I can ride by myself. I can enjoy nature. It gives me that little peace of mind that uh, you can't necessarily find being anywhere else. It's not just about exercise. It's about enjoying your environment, enjoying your community. I see the looks on people's faces now with this done that they're, they're really thrown back. It's the scenery, it's with all the work they've done here, it's just amazing. The San Antonio River Foundation is inspiring generations by developing educational facilities along the river for learners of all ages, while fostering a sense of ownership and responsibility for a healthy river. When the River Improvements Project is completed, San Antonio will boast one of the longest and largest urban linear parks in the nation, with over 2,020 acres of publicly owned parkland, two and a half times the size of New York Central Park, and over 26 miles of hike and bike trails. By providing outdoor fitness equipment, organic community gardens, public events, and river access through Confluence Park, the San Antonio River Foundation is adding to the recreational and fitness opportunities abundant along your river. The legacy we create now is a tremendous gift to our children, our grandchildren, and generations to come, making our city a happier, healthier place to work, live, and raise a family. You're going to see this legacy just, I believe, continue to grow and to grow and to grow. It's going to have a major impact, and we, we probably can't even measure the impact of it. To leave this for our son and our, and our daughter-in-law and our grandchild and, and know that hopefully they'll keep it in the family and they'll enjoy it generation after generation just like you know, we have it and how uh, Val's family has. When he comes to visit already, we see that, that gleam in his eye like, man, I'm, I'm looking forward to, you know, to the finishing of this project.
Well, I hope when my children grow up, they'll be able to connect to the river in the same way that I have. I think that that's really what the River Improvements Project is, is all about. It's being able to allow generations to come in and connect to it. The visitors that come and see the river, they're going to think, well, you know, the people that fix the river back the way it should be really had a lot of insight and it's going to really improve the quality of life for anybody that touches the river. My children want to visit the Riverwalk because of the public art along the museum reach and without the foundation's involvement these projects simply wouldn't exist. I think that the greatest impact that this project is going to have on the city has to do with the pride of the, the citizens of San Antonio. If you surround yourself with the beauty of nature, it helps to clean the mind and hopefully the soul.